Hey everybody, welcome back to Talk With Naya. So let's get right into it. We're going to start with the city girl. So Young Miami and JT go on Twitter and Young Miami tweets about missing the city girls. JT then says that she texts Young Miami about missing the city girls. So what's really going on with them? Okay, I've never seen this where people in a group saying, oh, we miss our group. All right, so what's going on with the group? Young Miami also replied to someone saying that they've been surviving off their old music and she said next year is going to be fun. So she's probably hinting at the fact that they will drop new music next year. Now, Young Miami also says that she wants another episode of Carisha Please and to put out an album as bad as her fans do. So what's really going on, girl? We haven't gotten an episode of Carisha Please in weeks. And why is that? And then y'all said the album was done like in July before Beyonce dropped her album. So what's going on with that? Okay, interesting. Now let's move on. So Tim's gets a lot of backlash, okay, after photos of her were released for Days Magazine, which shows her body. Tim's told those criticizing her that she's not their Christian savior, but people were calling her out saying, weren't you the one that said you were a church girl? Now you're acting shocked because people choose to hold you by the standards you set for yourself. So Tim said, you know, I didn't come here to uphold your beliefs about God. I will not try to fit into this box you try to put me in. So, you know, I showed you guys some of the pictures. So what do you guys think about that whole situation? All right, now let's move on to Glorilla. So Glorilla claps back on a DJ in Arkansas who said that Glorilla just called him and told him to pack his bags. It's time to turn this uh, his state up one more time. And she said, what are you talking about? I ain't say shit like that. I can hear Glorilla saying that too. So she called cap on this DJ, all right? So people just out here lying on her name, which is crazy. Now, speaking of Glorilla, it looks like her and Lotto are coming out with a song this Friday. So will you guys be listening? However, you know, there's always people in the comments and they were saying Lotto is trying to use Glorilla in this situation by collabing with her since Glorilla is hot right now. Now let's move on to Kim Kardashian. So Kim Kardashian is getting 200K per month in child support after her and Kanye West settle their divorce. Kanye also gives Kim the home he purchased next door to her as well. Okay, so Kim K is getting 200K her month oh my goodness now let's move on to Koi Ray. now let's move on to Koi Ray. so people think that Koi Ray is shading Nicki Minaj due to her tweet that says y'all see what Nas did now that's how the f you do it love always wins why downplay the next artist when you can uplift them and come together so we talked about this before how 21 Savage was saying that Nas was irrelevant and now it seems that the two have spoken and they have a song together that dropped called one mic one gun People were pulling up old tweets, though, of how Nicki Minaj supported Koi LeRae and chose to work with her on the song Blick Blick. So, what do you think is going on with Koi LeRae? Do you think she's talking about Nicki Minaj or shading her? You think there's beef between them? What do you think is going on? But that is all we have for today. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.